What up, guys? Disney Chubbs back at it again, and what are we doing today? What to bring to the parks now? Part two. But before we continue with the video, guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button, and at the end of the video, smash that like, because then you care. All right, so we wanted to make sure we um, went over a few things that we thought that is, can help it, you. Yeah, exactly. Is can it, help you. These are our own personal, um, what we think you can do to help your trip. <laughs> yeah, or, your or bring experience. with experience. Yeah. yeah, that that might keep make sure to lower You're the safe. risk of getting um, sick. Yeah, you know? keep you safe. It's not gonna keep you one hundred percent protected, but it, it'll help lower the risk right. just a little bit more. To give you better odds. Mm -hmm. May the odds be ever in your favor. <laughs> you know, it's almost like that. You know, we gotta go out there and be like, try not to get sick. <laughs> try not to get sick. You know? Don't touch so, me. So, yeah. So, <laughs> we wanna show you a few things, a few se a few um, examples of masks that you might wanna bring with you. Mm -hmm. Okay? Um, disposable and reusable. Because you do have to wear masks. You, you, yeah, well, yeah. I think from now on, everyone's going to have to wear Every, masks. Everybody, this is going to be something that you might as well just find something that looks good, and looks cool, that might be cool with you. It's because it's going to be the new norm. Um, the new norm is going to even try to, it's, I've seen people do fashion versions of them, of masks and stuff like that. So let's start off with the more important thing, masks. Okay? Yeah, that's like the main thing right now, you guys. So let me show you guys. There is um, this type of mask, which is like a kind of a reusable and disposable mask at the same time. Yeah. These are um, N95 or KN95s. Yeah, not the N95s. Uh, they're not N95s. These are, these are maybe like a step, they're like a knockoff version of the N95s, you know? But they still do good job. They still keep you, you know, at least 95% um, 90, or ni I think what it is, 95% or something like that safe, you know? Um, they protect, make sure you have it over your, over yeah, your make mouth, sure you guys are over wearing your nose. them right. Make sure you pinch this part right here, okay? Right here. Show this, them what not to do. This part right here, so that it hits flat and it doesn't allow any air to go in. Right? Right now, show, show, show it's me. all protected. Show us what not to do. What not to do? This! Why? Why even wear one? This, this does not help you. The virus doesn't says the virus doesn't the virus doesn't go. Oh wait, it's not your mouth. Let me go ahead and not go in there. <laughs> All right. You have Why to even wear one though? This, this, yeah. this is what you do. Okay, it's important. That makes sense. All right, you gotta stay this way. All right. The second one, another other mask that you um might wanna you might see out there is also the the disposable three ply. I which is this one a lot of people are wearing this they might even have them at the parks um to give you they might hand them out i don't know we don't know what what disney that's might a speculation do. speculation like i said i don't know allegedly i don't know but these are cheap these are disposable and they protect you enough like i said you put them over here you you pull this out so it covers up everything and then the important thing is to pinch down right here okay it's but very if I was important a German, I right but at least it'll do something. something. You know, it'll it'll peep, it'll keep people from coughing on each other, breathing on each other, okay, and you taking it in. Yeah. Okay, any little bit helps. Yeah. Okay. Now, that being said, you also have those kind of masks that um, that you see online. Actually, Disney is also selling some masks that are very similar to this. They're not exactly like this. They're but actually less than that. They're, they're, they're just a cotton. Okay, so these are the reusable ones. You can wash them, reuse them. With a okay? filter pocket. And there's a filter pocket. The, the, the Disney ones do have filter pockets. I remember seeing that uh, uh, online. And what they do is you can buy these filters or you can check out my next video on how to make your own filter coming up next week. Okay. And by the way, can I just say really quick before we get started, I had gotten these from a lady um, on Instagram, and I'll get him to put something in the link below, but it is Crafting in Chaos, and her name is Jamie, but I call her Lady J, and she has made these wonderful masks, and I mean, and they are really, 
well made mm -hmm. tightly woven tightly sewn um she takes any suggestions if you have a suggestion for her like you know i need more elastic or you know i need something a little, maybe a little lighter of a cotton on just the back um she takes wonderful suggestions so i will have her i'll put um, the, her link yeah. in the description below so you can and go she sells her masks for only five dollars and they're really well that's made. crazy five dollars is crazy because she's just doing it these things are being sold like Thirty bucks. Thirty bucks. Fifteen more. bucks. Twenty-five bucks. So, and she's doing it before we move on. And right. she's selling them for five dollars because she wants everyone to be safe. Exactly. And that's not with shipping. So plus shipping. <laughs> so just I wanted to put that out there. <laughs> yeah. So make sure you check out the description below. We're not sponsored. No, just, no, no. Sponsored. I just wanted to put it out there because she's bought, a kind person. We bought these too. Yeah, we okay. bought those and she's, a bunch for our family. Yeah, and we bought a whole bunch of for yeah for the family. <laughs> and so okay, so I found these on Amazon. These are the PM 2.5 filters. Um, they're readily available. Sometimes it takes a, a minute to get there, but they're, they're 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 disposable. So as soon as like you get liquid on it, you cough on it, you take on it, you take them out, throw it out, mm -hmm. right? And they go into this little pocket right here, you know. And the idea is to stop and catch everything mm -hmm. in that filter. So now you can put your mask on, and you're good to go. Make sure you squeeze right here. I mean, and these are really on your face. And this one, you can basically yeah, nothing. Nothing. Okay. The idea is, if you hold a, a, a like a lighter, and you can blow out the lighter with your mask, it is no good. Yeah. No good. It has to stop the the air from flowing out. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's the important thing. If you, mm -hmm. if you blow out the candle. And the, and the candle's still there, and the fire is still there, and you're good. That's a good way to test it, okay? Now, that'll, that'll tell you, this is a good mask, it's not a good mask. And that's a, it says, before we get, mm -hmm. it says Star Wars on it, because I know I'm going to get, we're going to get questions, it, just, it says Star Wars. Yeah, she makes uh, Stormtrooper ones, the Star Wars ones. She makes Disney patterns and Disney other regular patterns, patterns. Super cool ones. You can see them in our, in our Instagram. Yeah. I took some pictures, okay? Um, of course any little bit helps okay <laughs> but something like this where, where i've seen uh, a lot of people wear where it's just basically a piece of fabric yeah over your mouth like if i were to just throw does, this does that's it, a scarf i mean i've it, been seeing this it helps any little bit helps but it's not gonna keep you safe no okay these i mean these i bought because i was like okay maybe we need we need them right away and i needed them so i, I got them right away at the beginning of the whole covid thing so before we really knew so these they just you know it's basically just a, a thing like that right to keep the cold from you know, nipping at your nose you can you can double layer it but it's not gonna see wind still goes out <laughs> You can see it fog up. That's not good. That's not good. It's like so you're wearing a bandana on yeah. your face. It's just like wearing a bandana. I think even when a bandana might be better because this is even more. No, I'm talking about like a, a girl. But, girls know. Yeah. It's like a girly, soft, squinchy like yeah, it's, bandana. It's, it's that. It's that. Is that kind of fabric? Like that jersey. Yeah, shirt it's a very, fabric. very breathable. But very stretch. thin. The problem is, is that it's breathable, mm. and you don't need that, right? You, you need, need to breathe, but you can't. You like, need something breathe, that breathe. blocks the flow of air right yeah. there okay so that's one thing that um is important and you probably it, it will be required when you go to disney i think anything park okay i don't know <laughs> i've seen some the i have i use a valve one that um helps like it, it blows the air out but it doesn't allow air to come in mm. um i don't i went to the apple store and they said we don't accept those kind of masks in here so I had to put another mask on top of it um, so I don't know whether Disney might do that or not uh, but yeah, try to avoid to yeah try to avoid the valve mask if you can okay because the valve masks are great because that one is like a sport one and I can wear it all day and I can speak and I'm not eating fabric you know what I mean because these at one, at one time they go in your mouth and you all of a sudden they get all like slobbery and stuff and you're like oh my god I gotta take this off it becomes uncomfortable because yeah. I have a big face. I have a big head. So, you know. And one thing I just wanted to say is I have the these masks 
and I use them. But I do keep this little bag. I got this at Daiso Japan. And I do keep two little, the ones we just showed you. Disposables. The disposables in here just in case if I were to ever, ever forget my mask. Mm -hmm. I would recommend doing something like this and just keeping it in your purse. Or if you're going to take a backpack to the parks, I would recommend taking this and just kind of leaving it in your backpack. Mm -hmm. Anyways, sorry. Just wanted to take that. The next step to making sure you're, you're going to be in to lower the risk is hand sanitizer. Mm -hmm. Hand sanitizer is very important. Whether you take a big bottle like this, I don't know how they'll let you take this bottle, but I'm sure they don't have a palm. But yeah. you I take, take like one of two these. or three of these. I carry all a little, time. little travel one as well in my bag at all times, and I have it with me in my pocket at all times because and anything I touch, yeah. handrails, uh, you, a you door don't, handle. You don't even realize it yeah. when you're in line. You're freaking take. You're touching the dang rails because yeah. you're just like leaning and messing around. And I don't think we realize yeah. how much we touch, we touch the rails, rails in the queue line. Way too many times. Yeah, or so, we lean up against them. This is important. Yeah, very important. And also, no, no. there's a spray one too. Mm -hmm. So there's like a, a antibacterial spray one from Bath and Body Works. Bath and Body Works. Oh, and you guys, Bath and Body Works does have the five pack for eight dollars in these ones, and then they do have these ones, and they are pumping out antibacterial hand sanitizer like a mother oh my goodness you can go on the website right now you have to pay shipping but it's still worth it yeah. um and they do have hand sanitizer available so yeah. i know that was scarce for a while but it, they're just pumping it out so that everybody's safe yeah and if if you use these up you can always pop off the yeah lids. i didn't know that he showed me I, I pop them off and then i i, I refill them with the bigger bottle mm -hmm. we fill them up so i make sure i at least have this in my pocket at all, all times. times in my bag in my pocket anywhere any anything it needs to make sure i have this okay also um you want to talk about this okay so my mom and um my family but my mom she bought this stuff called you could, uh, okay i'm gonna say it, i'm gonna mess it up it's like udubon or odobon however you want to say it you can find it at Home Depot. You have to go in store and buy it. I don't think you can buy it online anymore. But basically, it is a anti um, it's antibacterial, but it's um, disinfectant spray, and it's um, concentrate. Yeah, it's so a, it, it comes, comes in a, a big, big old jug, and it has on the back the ratio to water, which you have to mix it with for what size bottle. Um, and it tells you exactly what to do. You just basically mix it with water, and then it just becomes. Disinfectant spray. Yeah, disinfectant spray and it kills germs like 99.9% .9%. so this is just an old Mario Bittasu facial spray bottle that I reused and cleaned out and I followed the instructions on the back of the ratio to do it and then I just keep this filled at all times it's kind of low right now but I mean I've used it a lot but <laughs> I just spray him down spray my surroundings down spray myself down and you know what? it doesn't stain it doesn't hurt. It doesn't harm your dogs. Um, no pets. It doesn't hurt your pets. And it doesn't stain. It doesn't have like a really bad odor to it. It's really nice. It's kind of like almost like eucalyptus -y floral, mm -hmm. floral kind of. Um, and it works great. I love it. And also you can put this in with the wash. So let's say if you come home and you throw your clothes in the washer, just put it. It will tell you how much to put per load, like what type of load you have, small, um, large, whatever. And it'll tell you what to put in there. And you could put it with your clothes and it disinfects your clothes. Right. So but if you don't have that, if you can't get Udubon, just get a little bit of um, alcohol, do a 50-50 mm -hmm. um, blend of water and alcohol, same one part, one part, and shake it up and you can spray the alcohol. It mm -hmm. cuts through. The main idea is to cut through the fat or fat cells that are carrying the virus mm -hmm. and so that cuts to the fat cells okay it's the same idea with the hand sanitizer mm -hmm. another thing i would say these are not antibacterial or clorox because i don't have those right now but if you can't get your hands on the travel size clorox bring those to the park the right. wipes you need wipes the reason why i have these is because i use this to spray down things and then use the wipes but bring the wipes because you need them you really need to clean even though i'm sure disney's gonna clean like crazy but just take it upon yourself to do the extra yeah, we have to do we have to be extra with this yeah we have to, we have to be extra with this yeah because it's your safety and my safety her safety it's everybody's safety right yeah. the idea is to make sure we try to slow it down and bring gloves 
gloves. That's another bring, thing. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't have them on me right now. But bring gloves. disposable gloves. Bring as many as you want. Like you're gonna need them. Yeah. And I would. I would try to wear those as much as you can because, yeah. like you said, we're touching everything. Right. And you don't know. Right. So as much as you are going to be wearing the mask, I would say wear gloves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Definitely wear gloves. Make sure you take them off before you take off the mask. Okay. Um. And then wash your hands before you take off the mask because. Whatever is on your hands is going to go on your face when you take it off, right? Mm -hmm. So it's important that you watch what you do with your hands, okay? Mm -hmm. Just like treat it like if you're about to do surgery, you're walking around like a surgeon, <laughs> you're just like, ah, you know, you can't touch anything. Mm -hmm. So use gloves all the time. And another thing, I just, just thought about it right now. I know a lot of you who go to the parks and go to these places, you guys can get those um, reusable battery packs for your phone for instagram doing all that type of stuff mm. bring your own power bank yes bring your don't, own power bank don't use those don't ones because you don't know that are in that. where they're coming from from I the wouldn't. machines i wouldn't i think they're called fuel rods yeah don't do that you don't know who's touching yeah who's whatever because you have to figure it I don't spits know out one cleaned from out. someone who's had it yeah so you don't know who had it yeah yeah don't do that yeah and I don't so, know if they're still going to do that, but if they still do have the option, don't do it. Don't do it. Bring your own power bank. Invest in a power bank and bring it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I just thought of that right now. I was like, you know, what's one thing that you can... Oh, there it is. And also, another thing is, before you get in the car, this is a major. This oh. is a major. Because I know we're going to have to do this. Before you get in the car, take your shoes off. Those are the most dirtiest things in the whole entire world. Yeah, you're gonna want to change your shoes. Get one of those plastic shoe boxes. I know what you're talking. I know you guys know what I'm talking about. You can find them at Walmart for like a two dollars, whatever. They're about the size that you can fit two shoes in, and we have them. I have two of them right there. Mm -hmm. They're pink topped. Um, but anyways, um, bring those. Throw your shoes in there and disinfect yourself. Disinfect the car. Dis before you sit down, I would even recommend doing that. Doing the extra. Change your clothes. Yes. Do what you have to do. If you're wearing any extra layers, take that dang layer off. Put it in a garbage bag and yeah. then put it in the trunk or something. Don't put it in there with you. you know? Don't. And spray yourself down. And you know, if you look crazy in the parking lot, oh, Who cares well. about looking crazy? <laughs> you're going to be safe. Yeah. <laughs> That's the important thing. You got to do the utmost. Yeah. You have to be super extra with all this stuff. Very extra. Mm -hmm. I, you have to be almost OCD to the point where you're a germaphobe. Yeah. Okay, the idea is to make sure we stay safe. Again, we have to stay safe. And the more the, the more we do this, the better odds that Disney will remain open and might open, you know, um, a little, you know, well, the opportunities to do other stuff in there mm -hmm. might open up. Okay, so we have to do our part to make sure that Disney stays open yeah. because if we if Disney opens up and this, the rise of COVID cases goes up, we're gonna get shut down again. Yeah. <laughs> and I I don't want to be shut down. I personally down again. can't. You know. I don't think anyone really wants that to happen. To be honest, I can't say I personally. I shouldn't say that. I think nobody wants that to happen again. Right. It's just really sad, and it's just like here we go again. <laughs> right. It's just tough. It's tough on everybody. It's tough on people out there. It's tough on us. It's tough on you. Um. So just be safe, guys. Yeah, guys. Be very, very safe, and make sure you stay tuned for next week's episode. I will show you how to make a filter for your mask. Mm. All right, guys. So that's a wrap, guys. Make sure you smash that like button and hit that notification icon. Ring a ding ding. And hit that subscription button. Hit it. <laughs> Share it with people. Share it with everybody. Your friends, your enemies, your mom, your mom, your dad, everybody. Mm -hmm. Share this video because it's important that they know what to bring with them to Disney and to any or park, really. Park or even or going any, anywhere outside. Anywhere going outside. It's important. Anywhere. Mm -hmm. It's important. Going so anywhere in public. Yes. <laughs> share it with everybody. It's important. Okay? All right, guys. Big chubs. Little chubs. Out. Mm -hmm.